Hi everyone, welcome back to Rotor Dynamics 101. Today we'll be diving into an important topic that often goes unnoticed until it causes significant problems, which is thermal issues in rotating equipment. Thermal problems can lead to severe vibration issues and even mechanical failures. In this video, we'll analyze the real-world case study involving in rotating equipment experiencing thermal complications. This case highlights a compressor with a centrally located motor that drives the impeller to generate the compressed flow. High power rotating machinery often operates with high voltages and fluxes, which generates excessive heat. When the motor heats up, overall machine efficiency decreases. To mitigate this, cooling systems are essential. There are many different cooling methods for the motors, such as forced air cooling, liquid cooling, and hybrid cooling. A liquid cooling jacket for motor is a cooling system designed to regulate the temperature of the motor by circulating a coolant, usually a liquid, around the motor casing. So the coolant absorbs heat generated by the motor's operation and carries it away, preventing the motor from overheating. If the liquid cooling jacket alone is insufficient, a nozzle can be installed to inject liquid directly onto the winding. In this case study, liquid cooling is applied. The liquid is injected from a nozzle directly onto the windings to lower the temperature and maintain compressor efficiency. However, one crucial detail must not be overlooked, which is nozzle alignment. If the nozzle is misaligned, and sprays liquid onto the unintended parts of the machine, it can cause temperature variations in crucial areas. For instance, in this case, the nozzle was spraying coolant onto the bearing housing, causing temperature differential on the bearing housing. Over time, this leads to bearing housing distortion, increasing vibration levels, and ultimately triggering a shutdown. To address the shutdown issue, Caused by high vibration, the nozzle angle was adjusted to direct cooling liquid flow, specifically on the motor winding. This modification prevented distortion of the bearing housing and ensured smooth operation. The figure illustrates the effect. The blue area indicates cooling from the nozzle spraying liquid onto the bearing housing surface, while the red area represents hotter regions. With the nozzle properly aligned to the motor winding, the bearing housing temperature becomes more uniform, shown by the orange areas. Please note that the vibration trip limit can be established for your machine, and exceeding this threshold triggers a shutdown to prevent potential catastrophic failure. Without a defined trip limit, the risk of severe equipment damage grows. Another case involves a pump suffering from similar thermal issues. Non-uniform expansion at the housing end cover caused by water condensation lead to internal misalignment. The figure shown here illustrates this, with the blue areas indicating cooler regions and the red areas representing the hotter regions. This temperature gradient causing the housing to bend resulting in misalignment. This phenomenon develops gradually over time rather than occurring instantly. Modifications on the seal design helps to resolve the issues by preventing the condensate buildup and minimizing the temperature differentials. Addressing these issues not only reduces the vibration but also extends equipment lifespan and reliability. The key takeaway here is that Conduct pre-installation finite element analysis to assess thermal and structural risk. Ensure continuous monitoring throughout the system's operation. And implement robust seal design to enhance reliability. By following these steps, we can mitigate unexpected failures and avoid costly downtimes. Proactive monitoring is crucial for long-term success. This is all I have for you today. If you find this video useful, hit that like button and subscribe for more insights. 
Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next videos.